What was that? What was that? What is that? Something is literally running back and forth behind him. That is terrifying. The cameraman must have been filming like... I don't know, keep going, keep going. What is that? Seriously, I thought it was like a, a nude man running back and forth, but then when they slowed it down, it looked like this... I don't even know. Some sort of blob floating back and forth. I always try to debunk these things, and this one I can't. If you're in white... Huh? To speak or to go to court? <laughs> That is terrifying. If that is a ghost talking to them with that evil cackle, that is absolutely terrifying. I have no clue what's going on. I just assume that they're contacting some sort of spirit, but how? Is there a spirit box there or something? Either way, that one gave me the chills. I did not like that person's evil laugh or that ghost's evil laugh. Also, I really like her neck tattoo. What happened? I don't understand. I was like waiting for something to pop up in the darkness behind that man. But then all of a sudden he was like, whoa. I did see something fly across the camera, but it looked like somebody's arm. So maybe like, I don't even know what happened. Hey everyone, what's up? Welcome back to Central Dark. I'm your host, Lindsay Ivan. And today let's look at these ghost sightings caught on live TV. Hmm, interesting. I can, I can see it, yeah. Go for it, go for it. See what? No, don't go for it. I'm, I'm not behind you, I'm not behind you. Hello? Hello? Oh, fuck. He fell downstairs. Who are you? Hello? Uh, who was that? Get your camera up here quick. We're going. It looked like your person, wasn't it? Definitely, yeah. Hello? Okay. Come on, if you hit. Oh, yeah. <gasps> what's that? What's that? There. Oh my God, that is fully a ghost of somebody walking up the stairs. That is so creepy. That, at first I didn't see what they were talking about, but they saw something and yeah, somebody slowly walking up the stairs or down the stairs, I can't tell. But then uh, it just disappears and they're like, there was a person here. Also, I love how the guy's like, whoa, I nearly fell. <laughs> like no one cares, just record in front of you. Because it's always when they turn the camera on themselves that we miss something. Whoa, I nearly, I nearly fell. Oh, the ghost just walked by again. We just missed it because I was filming myself. That's okay. What was that? It looked like somebody was like standing against the wall, like camouflaging in and then just like passed out or it was a creature. I don't know what that was. It was like a shadow person or something. And then the guy on the couch was like, yo, do you guys see the bird feeder swinging back and forth? And the girl's like, oh, stop it. There's nothing there. Don't scare us. But he probably saw that something fell. I, w I wanted to see if they scored. <laughs> As a soccer player, I was interested in the game, but I did see that creepy figure running across. It was moving a little too fast for my liking, though. There's no way. In a crowded stadium, you can't move that fast. Но, к сожалению, последние годы эта красота подвергается все большей опасности. Только за последние 350 лет... Олежка, сори. What? Ой, ничего себе. What? Что это? Вау. Wow. What the heck was that? At first I thought it was going to be like an orb that crossed the screen. 
But then it was like this weird light thing that just beamed up into the sky. Like, what is that? That's probably an alien of some sort. What was it? It definitely wasn't a glare from the sun, because I also thought that too, that it could just be like the sun rays. But that thing was super bright, and then all of a sudden it just disappeared into the sky and it was gone. So maybe it was like an alien spacecraft going back to its alien planet. It's a black shadow figure, like part of his lower legs were appeared to be actually underground. He's got a cowboy hat on, just hold his right arm up a little bit. It's almost like he has a bird on. Another image shows crosses. Obviously there's no crosses here. But they appeared right when this picture was taken. Pete describes an encounter when he left a voice recorder out overnight. There's a message that wasn't very nice. What was that message? It was die, Pete. Three times. <laughs> so that was literally told him to go die. Um, yeah, maybe not go wherever that is. Just get out of there because that's the ghost's uh, home. It's a cowboy ghost from the Wild Wild West. <laughs> Die, Pete. Let's have a standoff. Last season, they were a bit of an unknown quantity. Nobody really set up to play to nullify the strengths. This season, I think teams are ready for them. And I think they're going to have to come up with a different way of playing because what? teams aren't now going pressing and leaving the space in behind. There's no space now for Jamie Vardy or for Mares. People are doubling up on him and they're going to have to find another way. A ghost was just walking on the field and then disappeared without a trace and then teleported backwards and then continued walking. My only thing would be if they're not in front of... Because right now where it's filming, it looks like they're in front of windows that overlook the stadium, right? Unless those are TV monitors and they already have pre-recorded footage on there and then the footage that they took was of like, I don't know, the groundskeeper doing the grass and it's like on a loop. So that's why it looked like he was walking and then transported. And then I saw the legs and it was a human. But not a real human. No. It was just like this. So Romero reported it and told his supervisors. They say there is no way in or out of the secured area without an open gate and alarm sounding. You can see it walk through. It walks in the direction of the old uh, transport cages. And there's not really any way for it to get out through there, but it walks, seems to walk right through that. That's creepy. Imagine, oh God, I don't know how security works night shifts. I'd be so terrified of seeing something on the security cameras. Oh man, I hope they get paid more than daytime security because that is so creepy. Like this guy was probably just chilling, eating a sandwich, eating some pretzels or something. Then he's like, oh snap, that's a ghost. All right, guys, that's all the ghostly clips I'll be reacting to today. Get it? Ghostly clips. I'm so clever. I'm oh, sorry. Um, if you like this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and comment something down below. And of course, subscribe to our channel. That being said, check out these bloopers. Stay safe, guys. I want to go ghost hunting. I feel like Keegan, and I, Keegan, Lucy, and I would like be super good at ghost hunting. I don't know. Keegan would just be making jokes all the time while Lucy and I just, you know, cower in fear behind him. Um. <laughs>